Mrs. Carberry and more, 832-221-4007. Website is carberrysandmore.com. How hot is it right there? 137. 137. Okay, Mr. Ken, here's your carburetor. This finish on here has been electrolyte put on there. It's one of the best finishes you could get. It needs nothing done to it. Absolutely. However, you're absolutely 100% wrong trying to stick with that antique choke. You need to put an electric choke on there. You know, it's your carburetor, but if you want, you, you, you basically, you spent 250 bucks to get it rebuilt. Whoever had it apart when they were doing this coating, this thing was on backwards. There's a bunch of parts inside that weren't correct. And we had to do extensive modifications on the inside to get it to burn the, the today fuel of ethanol. Having said that, sir, at 137 degrees, you've done, it's just like getting the, putting four brand new tires on there and then don't tighten up the lug bolts. You went through all this money to get this fixed, and I'm trying to know I'm talking to myself, and then put to put that choke right there that I never did work on it was brand new. It's kind of going backwards, but it's your money, but we can still do it if you tell us before we box it up and before you pay for it. But here it is. We could not duplicate your high-speed um, fading out or whatever it was doing. We ran it till we, we ran it till it was almost in a danger zone. But here we go again. Okay, this thing really runs sweet. And before it wouldn't even idle. And when you'd go to accelerate it, it would die. And you see, we're accelerating it just like driving down, just like driving to church on Sunday. This linkage here was all bent up. The ventilation wasn't venting correctly. Okay, now here we go. We're going to put the big load on it. We got it on. We got it on. Here we go. Five mile an hour there for a good two or three minutes. We didn't time it, but if it was going to fade out or top, fall off on the top end, it would sure done it. Okay, take it out of gear and we'll give him a free rev. Okay. okay, if you change your mind on an electric choke, it don't have to come back out here on the test dyno. But it's got fully tested, road tested, full load on it. I don't know how many would have put a 10,000 pound load on it, I think. And uh, it's carburetor doesn't hesitate one bit. You got your good vacuum readings and stuff for your uh, vacuum advance. Watch, read all the videos, watch, well, watch the videos and read them all the instructions and you'll have no trouble. She'll run perfect for you. Okay, we're going to go in and try to get your money.